So the update finally came out and I'm both really excited and really nervous, especially for one dino in particular, my Metri. Metri was my first dinosaur, so it's a little sentimental. All right, let's see. I don't even have a bite equipped. Right. Okay, here we go. Here's the good stuff. Of course I have to be in a home game. I know that. Healing call. Hopefully eventually they'll give me my own icon. Intimidating screech. That's good. Primal mend for solo players like uh, my Metri. I'm not gonna lie, I don't group up very often when I play my Metri. Alright, so let's get us to a home cave so we can hurry up and get those equipped. Yeah! I gained a whole group slot worth of dino weight. I don't know how to move anymore. <laughs> I am really not in a position for an encounter. It's a pick no making all that noise. I only have like one attack equipped. I really can't handle you right now. I ain't got time for your nonsense. <laughs> I'd be more worried if I was someplace like Savannah or the Grasslands. Whatever. Not so much here. This is a pretty good place to fight a Pycno. <laughs> or run away from one in our case. <laughs> oh, I'm just now noticing the little combat music. Got some drums going. Well, that's nice. I actually like the music. I know I tested it out on the, uh, the PTB a little bit. But it's nice. I, I like it. I hear him. I'm trying to see if he'll attack or not. Nope. Oh, look. Even the music changed. Oh, that's neat. Pretty intuitive. Hmm. I honestly wonder if I'll keep the music on or turn it off. I don't know. All right, finally, we made it. I have limited funds. Some of my dinos did better at farming marks than others. <laughs> but I tried to save up a little. Okay, since my Metri is mostly solo play, I'm gonna go with the Primal Mend. Absolutely. But I am gonna get Intimidating Screech. Yes. Though I will eventually also get the Healing Call for the groups. Uh, but when I am in a group, and I can just run to the home cave and switch them out. Still seems like such a weird idea to have the Metri be the healer, though. The Metri of all the dinosaurs. The Metri. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. I don't really care much for hustle. Okay, but let's get out of here. Try it out. Maybe we can get lucky and actually find that Pigno that was around here. He was here like a minute ago, or two. <laughs> the rain's not helping. I think I hear him behind me. rain. <laughs> oh, that is crazy fast good healing. come from? You stole my trophy, you little shit. <laughs> Get over here. Damn it. <laughs> Normally I give the trophies to babies anyways, but you just bold as brass came over and stole it, you little thief. <laughs> now you must pay the price. The penalty. Might be death. Maybe. Maybe, baby.
<laughs> oh, that is fantastic. <laughs> He's carrying his friend. <laughs> oh. oh, you guys are adorable. Still gonna kill you, though. Dang, if I can hit you. Come here. I had heard the little Latin earlier, but I didn't even know they were just like hanging out. They were probably in a group together. Oops. <laughs> not the not that I'm the best at finding trophies that have been dropped on the ground, but I really don't see it at all here. So he must have dropped it a lot earlier. And I'm just not gonna go looking for it that hard. Nope, don't care that much. <laughs> oh well. Still fun though. So I had my hesitations, but I will admit, I'm starting to feel pretty good about the metri changes. And in fact, I'm almost feeling too good. Like these things are going to become seriously obnoxious. Seriously obnoxious. But I still love my metri. Oops, but I did have to go back because I forgot one thing about the metri. They also have, ta-da, Lone Hunter now. That would have been awesome a couple of minutes ago. <laughs> oh well, but yeah, that's, that's the one I'm going to run default. I think that's going to be the good one. Yep. For me and my metri anyways. Now to test out my most recent pride and joy, my little Latin. Okay, so there we go. We have the raptor strikes. That's definitely one we're getting. Oh crap, I'm broke. I forgot about that. <laughs> It's okay, we're just gonna do some quests as we go ahead and head towards the home cave. Ah! Ow! Oh no, and I did it again! <laughs> no, it's fine. It's fine. I'm a Latin. I'm a Latin. I'm immune to gravity. Most of it. <laughs> Thank goodness. Ah! That was not intentional. <laughs> okay, and we're back. And now we have pounce! Yay! Though we're gonna have to wait on slick feathers, but that's definitely something I'm investing in as a tiny raptor. Oh, and looky here, there's already some nonsense I want to be a part of. I don't want to accidentally hit any of them, though. Oh, these things. Are gonna be vicious in a pack. <laughs> oh my goodness. We're not catching an Alio, but here's to hoping. I lost him. That's okay. Still had a chance to help a few Latins out. That was nice. Heck yeah! Latins are always better in packs. I needs to ride a dinosaur around, okay? That's what I need. I need it in my life. I need to pounce on something. <laughs> oh, Latin! Picno! Something! Hello! You're my friend now. Come on! More Latins! I hear that. I hear that noise. I must pounce. Oh goodness, I'm having Utah Raptor pounce mechanic flash flashbacks. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Dang it, I keep missing. Come here! Come here, I gotta, gotta ride ya. Success! <laughs> I 
Nom! <laughs> oh, that really drained your stamina, though. <laughs> oh, so much fun. Oh, I love it. Oh, no way! <laughs> I hope I got it. <laughs> oh. Oh, that is fantastic. This is the best game ever now. <laughs> oh, no, it's okay. Oh, oh, he brought us his tooth. Is it a trap? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah. Oh. oh, no, he was giving it to us. Oh, oh my God, I laughed so hard, my head hurts. <laughs> that was beautiful. Fantastic. Thank you for the trophy. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Whew. I've got this. <laughs> And a quick shout out to Rainbow Sparkle who asked if I was the real yarn fossil. And yes, I am. They were the croc that snatched that Sarah. <laughs> now on to the next baby that I'm kind of worried about. My Sarah. I'd become so reliant on Leap that I'm a little bit nervous about it. I'm also definitely thinking kick over shove. Though I will get both. Oh, shoot. Broker than I thought. Though both Berserker and All for One will absolutely, we'll get those eventually. Now all we need is to find something to kick in the face. No, we can't be kicking little baby spinos in the face. Can't do that. It's brood. My Metri might have murdered everything else that was already here. Okay, but let's check out how bad the fall damage is now. Oh, <laughs> I might want to try a little higher. <laughs> okay, so we can take little, little steps off ledges. Get a little more air this time. Oh, shoot. <laughs> All right, <laughs> try it again. Now with feeling. All right, there we go. I love the Ceratosaurus, but man, I keep getting some kind of whiplash with this thing. <laughs> like, as soon as I feel really comfortable, they change it. And not just like a little, like drastically. <laughs> then I get used to it and I love it again, and then they change it again. Uh, are we done? Can I have a Ceratosaurus now? <laughs> is this it? <laughs> is, this a, is this its final form? <laughs> Stop toying with my emotions! <laughs> All right, let's see. I just realized that sound has me really nervous. <laughs> all right, we have our berserker. I forgot to say anything. We will absolutely get for the all for one for when we're in groups. That'll be scary awesome. <laughs> I honestly have little to no interest in thrash because I can't even begin to tell you how many times I've had it come so close in a fight, I mean, I just feel like that 25% damage of me taking damage, eh, too much. I'm also not very interested in shove, but we can at least check out the animation for it. I figured we're not finding anyone, so we might as well just go ahead and just test them out at least. See how they look, all that, in game, not on the PTB anymore. There we go, nice little kick, bites. Don't share a cooldown. Nice. Kick does take a little bit of stamina. But your charged bite does not. So, there you go. Might have lost leap, but I feel like that's a pretty good combination for me. At least I'm pretty sure this is most likely the one I'm going to roll with when I'm not in a group. Alright, let's at least go look at shove. I'm not even real sure if it does any kind of damage, to be honest. 
There we go. About a three second, four second cooldown. Four second. Alright, so we at least see what it did, you know? Nice. Yeah. Not the way I'm gonna roll with it, but yeah. I, I think I'm gonna stick with the kick. Now, shove would have been interesting if we still had our leap ability, but without it, kind of like who am I gonna shove off a cliff? You know? Eh. I'd be at risk. <laughs> that and it takes stamina too, so, you know? Mm. If I'm draining stamina, I'm kicking something in the face. That's just all there is to it. My Meg got toxic scream. Oh, words. Toxic scream. <laughs> Oh, who the heck just leaves their megs lying around in a lake? What a terrible place to log off. <laughs> Alright, let's check it out away from the water. Especially in this day and age. And there it is. Yeah. Ah, of course I'm broke. Kind of forgot about the meg. <laughs> I didn't farm her any money. It's fine. As soon as I can walk again with my adult debuff going. Yeah, you're thinking about it. Good thing. He thought better of it. A wise birdie decision. <laughs> Would have taken you for a ride to the bottom of that lake. <laughs> then nom the stuffing out of you. <laughs> I'm the only thing with venom left. <laughs> Alright, finally. Here we go. We also get the all for one. It's pretty nice. I think just about every medium-sized dinosaur carnivore has gotten this thing. I said dinosaur for shame. <laughs> carnivore. I meant carnivore. <laughs> okay, we've got it equipped. I just want to see if it'll scream underwater. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Noise. About a five minute cooldown. Not bad. Not bad. I want to bite at least one thing. Hmm. I saw something. I'm not the best swimmer. There it is. Little baby Rex. Yeah. I'm not eating a baby Rex. Their life's hard enough as is. What's up, Baby Rex? I'm here to inform you. There are no gators. Just a Meg. This Rex looks very suspicious of the situation. Double checking that there are no gators. I promise you it is free and clear of gators. I don't know. Maybe this uh, T-Rex is too little to speak local. <laughs> Hasn't grown up enough to figure out how to tab over. <laughs> Look at him trying to sneak off. That's adorable. <laughs> you're right. You're so sneaky. I don't even see you at all. Good job, little Rex. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay, I'm a liar. Now there's a gator in this lake. I wonder if he'll go after the little spino over there. Or is it a big spino? Can't really tell from here. All right, do I want to be on land? Do I want to check my chances in the water? water. Not the best aquatic person, but I can usually avoid things on my meg. Oh fish, I thought you were a gator. Oh no, but that's a gator. <laughs> I found him. Are you nice? I don't think you're nice. Not right now. Ah! He also has a whole upda update to explore. Of course he's not going to be a nice gator. <laughs> Why would I expect any differently? At least I have options. <laughs> like running away on land. No, oh no, he is going for the little spino. It's not that little of a spino, but I don't know if it can take on a whole grown gator. I'm unfortunately not very fast, though. <laughs> not as fast as a Sarko, anyways. <laughs>
Either way. Objective achieved. We really were just here for a distraction so the Sarko could get away. I mean, not Sarko. Oh my gosh. Spino. And, uh, job done. There you go, little Spino. Live another day, little Spino. Live another day. <laughs> Suko also got a couple of good updates. Um, I have to admit, I'm not the best. I don't play my Suko very much. I should. But yeah, they've got Lone Hunter now. That's nice. But what we want is the Claw Barrage. Yeah, the Claw Barrage. That's it. So we'll equip that one. Everything else is looking pretty much the same other than... Here we go. Stop. I want to try it at least. Does mean we lose our webbed feet though. Which, mm, makes us slower in water, but if we're stomping around, maybe we want to be a land critter. Sort of like the Meg, but with options. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think that's the little Spino that we saved earlier on our Meg. Or helped out. <laughs> I'm not going to say we saved him. <laughs> that's the claw barrage and kind of like with the raptor bites the more you use it the more it increases nice let me find some flat ground <laughs> <laughs> I think the little spino behind us kept hearing us attacking things came to check it out <laughs> I'm not really attacking anything. Just air. All right, here we go. And smush. That'll show them pesky little raptors. <laughs> it's pretty slow though. Maybe if you got something tail riding you. Is it really gonna be that valuable with all those raptors on your back? I mean, that's a lot of raptor space right there. <laughs> but yeah, it's got its little AOE effect. Still pretty nice, I like it. Not really sure if it would be a good trade-off for the webbed feet. I guess it just depends on how aquatic you want to be. My aloe. <laughs> kind of a love-hate relationship with this girl. I love her to pieces. The world hates her. <laughs> she actually recently got respect too. I decided to go from speed to defense, which was awesome, and then back to basic. <laughs> Which actually, for me and the way I play, seems to be working. Oh, hatchet bite. Okay. I don't think this is something that I want to keep, but I want to check it out at least. I mean, my aloe is a lot of fun. I just struggle to keep it alive. Everything pretty much just looks at it and goes, yeah, I'm going to kill it. <laughs> I am really close to starving and out here trying out my hatchet bite. Yeah. All right. Well, hopefully we'll grab a snack and not die. hatchet bite on that lizard felt like overkill. <laughs> a few second cooldown. And it looks like it takes down. Let me stop moving and test that out. Yep. So if you did do a hatchet bite, it does take the stamina. So does your claw attack. That leaves you the tail, which is kind of meh. Good for things like packies. I don't even know how much of an issue they're going to be anymore. I feel like everybody's going to be a Metri and a Latin and a, just the Raptors in general. <laughs> mm. Yeah, unless until I have a chance to actually test it out on someone to try the bite, I don't know. But either way, I think I'll stick with the regular bite for now. Just find the stamina drain too concerning. And honestly, if you're you run a defense aloe with like traction and claw hatchet bite i mean you'd be it'd be a bit rough <laughs> you'd be out of stamina wouldn't be able to get any back but oh well yeah i'll go ahead and put her back to the way she was and put her back in with her nice little pretty new brand new skin yeah all right moving on so once upon a time i had a fully grown spinosaurus then i deleted it and made this guy because of updates and I got him halfway and decided to wait until after the next update. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe someday we'll get to him. But I don't think he's big enough right now to really check out the updates with. Oh well. 
Ah, my lamb. <laughs> Let's see how she's doing. So like before, we had our two voice slots, but now we got Primal Mend. Yes, one for us. Ugh, why am I so broke? <laughs> I actually thought I'd save someone. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> and Lone Survival. Uh, but we'll just try to get the, uh, the Mend one now. Who knows, after this update, I might actually love my lamb more than I did before. <laughs> Why is it trying to get me to buy my tail attack again? I have my tail attack. This is an issue. Yeah, it wants me to pay money for something I already have. Armored tail. I don't... Uh, on a lamb, I mean, I only have two attacks. I don't know why I would take one of them off. And the tail is kind of the big deal. Of course I was on the side of a cliff. What would, why else would I put my lamb? What was I doing there? <laughs> this lamb is still slightly cursed, I see. Ain't got time to mess with you. I'm gonna die of thirst. <laughs> Look, if you just want to ride, that's fine. No, you're gonna be a jerk about it. <laughs> I am too thirsty. Get off me. Wow, look at that bleed. You crazy little bugger. <laughs> I'd be much more relaxed, but I'm literally gonna die of thirst. You little sucker. Might have to take a little bit of that hit. The bleed hit, that is. But I'm gonna start draining life if I don't get up there. But I'm still impressed for one little tiny raptor. One little Deinonychus did all that damage. I mean, most of it's bleed, but still. <laughs> I can't do anything about that right now. I'm going to die. There we go, finally. Sheesh. But yeah, look at that. That's one little chicken. A pack of those would tear me apart. Luckily, I have a healing call. Just not yet. That would have been nice. <laughs> Wow. They're coming back for more? Well, how about a swim then? Look, I can shake in the water and half drown you. Look at that. <laughs> oh, my turning sucks. If I turned better, you'd be dead. <laughs> They're still pretty fast. Can't really catch these guys. Maybe a Latin. Yeah, he too quick for my little lamb sauce. But goodness, look how much damage he did. That's one little bird. Again, most of it's bleed because I couldn't be patient and wait it off. I was thirsty. But either way, let's get out of here. I don't feel like fussing with a chicken. For the embarrassment if I lose to one. <laughs> All right, so we finally got our mending call, and all we need now is to just go ahead and try it out. Too bad we didn't have it when the little chicken was attacking us. That would have been nice. Okay, so obviously we need to take some damage. Ledges are always pretty good for that. Jeez, most of the time. What, now you don't want to fall off a cliff and hurt yourself? Whatever. Maybe I need a better cliff. There we go. That's better. We'll just do one more for good measure, though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. That. Close enough. Close enough. <laughs> there we go. All right. Short sweep to the point. Really nice solo healing, though. Love it. Nice. Now, maybe they can change all these icons around to make maybe some of the healing not look exactly like the lamb. And maybe not make the venom look so much like the Metri's face. <laughs> I don't know. Just a thought. All right. Enough of that. Now it's time for the tiny T-Rex. It's that piercing bite. We're just going to try it. Oh, carnage. 
Okay. I didn't see this one on the list. It's probably in that big master list in there. But increases the attack by 20% within 75 meters of a corpse. Huh. Yeah, I didn't see that in the list. I mean, interesting. I, I, I'm definitely going to get it. Is it per corpse? <laughs> that could get interesting. <laughs> Neat. Does it apply to AI corpses? Interesting. That is a very long cooldown, though. Was that, wasn't that like 20 seconds? Heavy bite has like... Oof. Depending on how you wanted to run it, you could have... Ugh. I mean, four or five seconds that you can attack back if you went with like a heavy bite and the armor bite. But then again, I guess you could pick your armor piercing one. Um, but it does low damage. So, I don't know. If it ignores weight, is your weight even going to matter? That's definitely one we're going to have to look at. Oh, what's this? I'm on a community server, so I can't just run over there and bite them. In fact, I'm on a heavily, heavily ruled <laughs> community server. Otherwise, it would have been partially tempting. Oh, unless they attack me, then I can bite them back. Hello, T-Rex. He's also getting kind of close. Little baby T-Rex. Are you trying to be my friend? We can't be friends. I'm not a... Not a real T-Rex. <laughs> I mean, technically, I probably could have yelled at him and bit him for being close, but they were just being nice. I mean, or perhaps they thought we could be buddies. I get it. It's confusing. I look like a little Rex from a distance. Real quick on the pick note, we're going to look at Bulldoze. The new shout. Nice little animation there. Now we'll look at Horn Swipe. <laughs> I like it. He looks very spazzy. <laughs> kind of like he's saying, Give me space! <laughs> Love it. Now really quick, we're jumping over to our Alberta. They've got Enrage. And Berserker. So let's see that animation for the Enrage. Nice. I like it. About 30 seconds of increased damage, so not too bad. Alright, so that's just me looking at my dinos. Checking them out after the update. I was supposed to have this video out earlier, but unfortunately I had some editing fiasco to where I lost half my stuff and had to re-edit it. But it's pretty close to how it originally was. But when it comes to the actual update, um, I have to admit that I've been pleasantly surprised. Even with some of the dinosaurs that I was really concerned about, like my Metri and Sarah. But overall, it's been a ton of fun and I can't wait to check out some of the other new dinosaurs. Or the other not dinosaurs. <laughs> Don't forget to check out Happy X TikTok on that gator grab. And overall, I hope you had fun. I really did. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye.